being a Nigerian and born into a Catholic home, I was made to understand that tattoo is evil. But studying in Cape Town, South Africa has changed that perception. I have four tattoos, one over year, one over year, one year and one year. I do this because I saw my boss have one and I just love it because I love art. I had the tattoo done actually when I was in my 40s. I still am, but um, soon after a, a relationship breakup. Tattoo is like a lifestyle in Cape Town. Oh, I quickly fell in love with tattoos. And I told my friends in Nigeria about my plans to draw a tattoo on my body. Let's see what they had to say. And one of them even quoted the Bible. Or has he misquoted the Bible? Though it's my life and my choice, but their responses were not encouraging, so I took to a research. Tattoo has always been a part of us. So basically I find that like tattoos is develop, like developing over time now, especially considering like our technology, our constant like growth of technology and things like that is basically creating more acceptable for it to be within like an everyday manner, hence why like jobs are more like okay with people having tattoos in like showable areas and things like that. Um, regarding our needles, um, it's only about two millimeters that actually penetrate your skin. So basically, people that are scared of needles, they come to find that they don't have, they don't actually have a fear of it in the end. And also, the actual pain that you're experiencing isn't as extreme as what um, social media and people portray it to be. Like. For argument's sake, I know that in the past they used to have what you call a road, um, a coil machine. And like with our technology that has also grown now, like tattoos can last longer, like can look better for longer. Um, it won't bleed underneath your skin, cause blotchiness. Like our cleanliness and everything as like technology has taken us has basically created more okayness for tattoos, hence why it's grown within a more sociable manner. So on my way out of a tattoo shop, still on my insatiable search for knowledge about tattoos, I stumbled across my friends from Nigeria. And guess what? I quickly set up my camera just to get their views on tattoos while they were in Nigeria and now they are in South Africa. We have a perception that you know, you're serious, you're, you know, this pretty girl's son or daughter, if you tattoo, you know. Most people in Nigeria that have tattoo are those people mostly in the entertainment world. You know, you see the video, you see whiskey. That's how to show that, you know, they belong to, you know, the showbiz, you know, community. But I think generally it's really not acceptable in Nigeria, especially in Nigeria being a very religious country.
Um, like um, obviously, South Africa is a very artistic um, country, most especially Cape Town. Cape Town, in precise. Um, Cape Town is pretty artistic. You go out, you see a lot of graffiti on the wall. You see people covered in tattoos. You know, so I think it's pretty cool um, that you're in a place where you you're not labeled for having a tattoo. So I think Cape Town has pretty much changed. Um, my uh, view of tattoo compared to what I used to think of it and how people um, used to regard it uh, way back in Nigeria. Uh, most definitely I'm gonna get, get a tattoo. Not even a tattoo, what am I saying, a tattoo? I'm gonna get like two or three tattoos. <laughs> If I'm going back to Nigeria, so definitely I'm gonna get a uh, get a tattoo or tattoos. Uh, when I go back to Nigeria, I'm gonna get tattoos. Definitely. Um, <laughs> that's a tricky one. Uh, well, you know, everyone that loves tattoo does not necessarily have to wear tattoo. I think I'm just a very open-minded person. I love the Zadro tattoo, but for me, nah, I don't think so. For now, who knows? You know. I just believe something that every tattoo I'm gonna draw on my body has to mean something to me, it has to be very significant. You know, so yeah. I think let's wait till that significance comes before I draw one. So with all I have known thus far, am I still going to draw a tattoo on my body? Yes. But how will I handle the reactions at home? Quite frankly, I don't know.